Hi and welcome to this Stahl's CAD Cut Direct production tip jar and today we have a lesson all about pressure. For this lesson on pressure we're going to show you how to make a grilled cheese and illustrate that back to garments and decorating them and pressure. So let's get started by buttering up our uh, pieces of bread to prep for heat printing our grilled cheese. Next of course we need to add the slice of cheese in the center. and then we'll position it on our heat press. Notice we have the quick slip pad protector loaded onto the bottom. That way the butter won't ruin the pad. Easily cleanable and the non-stick cover sheet. And let's lock it down to heat print it. We're actually gonna apply 60 seconds on one side and then we're going to flip it over and apply in another 60 seconds on the other side. You'll notice when I position the grilled cheese onto the heat press, the crust and the main part of the bread are all laying on top of the press. If you know anything about bread and making a grilled cheese, you know that the crust usually sits up higher than the major uh, components or the center of the bread. For this reason, we know that we have a nice white mark in the center of our grilled cheese and it is not perfectly browned at all. We can illustrate this back to laying a t-shirt, a team jersey, or anything directly on top of a heat press without threading it onto the press. Basically by doing this you're creating uneven pressure areas, browning the seams, the sides, the zippers of the shirt that are sticking up higher than the level of your print area and leaving the print area basically unbrowned, uncooked, unadhered to the garment. For this reason we've innovated threadability at Stahl's Hotronics. An innovation such as the heat press caddy and the heat press counter caddy, which allow for easy splitting of garments, not grilled cheese, threading onto the lower platen, and ultimately creating a nice even pressure on your print area, not being impacted by the crust or the seams. This has been a lesson in heat printing by making a grilled cheese. Thanks for watching.